Hey guys, this is Comic You Know, and today I'm doing a review for Superman issue one. Uh, I got the David Mack cover, I believe. Uh, let's start talking about this issue, though. So with this one, it is the first official, I guess, Brian Michael Bendis Superman uh, story, because the other ones were Man of Steel leading into the Superman story. Uh, so let's start talking about this. Uh, we get to see Ivan Reyes on artwork, which is just gorgeous the artwork for this book. Um, the colors, the inks, it's just so good for this book. I love it. I love the emotions. It just felt so complex and just I, I really enjoyed uh, the paneling as well. Uh, one of my favorite parts of this issue was uh, when Superman and Martian Manhunter are talking to each other and we get to see Superman running back and forth trying to like, oh, I gotta like punch a dinosaur, I gotta go do this, and then he goes, continues the conversation, just showing how quick Superman is, uh, and, you know, using his super speed in, in his flight. Uh, I mean, just look at these pages, they're so great. Uh, but yeah, really enjoy the collaboration between these two creators, and I really enjoyed this issue, uh, even compared to the Man of Steel stuff, and I think because we didn't see the villain in this issue, and that was kind of lackluster part was the villain for me, and it was just about Clark dealing with his emotions with his wife and child not being with him, and he misses them, and he still has to do his normal stuff. He still has to go to the Daily Planet, he still has to, you know, hang out with the Justice League, do stuff with that, uh, deal with Fortress Solitude stuff, and rebuild that, uh, and I thought it was a really good kind of epilogue slash beginning to what we saw with Man of Steel and you got the emotions and I think this is some of Brian Michael Bendis's best work that we've seen in a while uh, with this particular issue. My only nitpick with this issue, why I couldn't uh, go a little higher, I, I gave this four and a half stars though, really enjoyed it. Like I said, I thought this was a really good first issue, uh, but the last part of this issue becomes <laughs> really quick for me. Uh, we find out that Earth is in the Phantom Zone and I was like, whoa, what? And it ha the, the moment really happens quickly and I felt like there could have been a bit better of a transition to that uh, with many other things kind of weaved into this issue leading into that moment. But other than that, that's just a small nitpick I had. I still think that's a really interesting cliffhanger to see where they go. And like I said, I really enjoyed this first issue. So I'm giving, I'm giving this one four and a half stars. Uh, probably my favorite Brian Michael Bendis issue so far for Superman. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. This is Comic Uno. Don't, uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also description below, there are links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. And I will see you guys later. Bye.